Hello. So you have a remote management profile on your iPhone, iPod, or iPod, and you want to remove it. What you should do is, first of all, I'm going to show you that I'm running an iPhone 7 with iOS 11.3.1. So, what we need to do is um, restore it, but before restoring it, you will um, get the serial number and email it to me or use WhatsApp to this site. Go over this site, mdmbypass.com. And you'll pay $20 if you uh, contact him first and tell him that, that I sent you he's gonna give you this a discount you put here your serial number pay using PayPal $20 but again if you contact him first he'll give you a, a discount here's your his number send him your serial number and download the MDL tool either for Windows 32 or 64 bits or for Mac so once you do that you're gonna restore in iTunes you're gonna restore the new iOS on it but to do that you have to uh, put your phone in DFU mode and you'll do that by pressing the power button and turn it off then you're going to both press the volume down and the power button at the same time for three seconds and then you're gonna let go the power button but keep holding the volume down the button here we go both at the same time one, two, three. You wait until that disappears. Four, seven, eight, nine, ten. Turn it, take it off. And you're gonna hear a shine. Well, my speakers are off, so we're not gonna hear it, but the computer will recognize it. It says, it has been detected that in recovery mo mode, you must restore this iPhone before it can be used with iTunes. So you just re restore it, restore an update. Here, it says iOS 11.3.1. Next, agree. And we'll just wait until software downloads it's going to take a while so i'm going to pause the video and be back once this is almost ready and yes once it's downloaded it will start recovering on the iphone you'll see the progress the the apple logo and the progress bar and i'll be back once that's been going on once it has finished restoring from itunes it's going to disappear from the computer and it's gonna the progress bar is gonna continue happening on your iPhone you close iTunes you open up the tool you download it from the in the end site you'll see the tool here it will recognize your iPhone or iPad you wait until it recognizes and you get this screen here press bypass and the M it's processing please wait and you will say bypass done so let's take a look on the phone itself
But once you pass that last page, you know you're set. And welcome to your iPhone. That's it, folks. Oh, let me show you that we are indeed in 11.3.1. There you go. Enjoy.